I recently met a corporate lawyer called Polly Higgins and she said, let's eradicate ecocide. And I said, huh? You know how there's an international criminal court that tries individuals for crimes against peace, right? Well, this court is in The Hague in the Netherlands and their job is to bring to justice criminals who have committed international crimes, like for example genocide, which is the destruction in whole or in part of an ethnic, racial or religious group, or crimes against humanity, where one or more human beings have been systematically humiliated through murders, rape, torture and persecution, or war crimes when human rights have been violated during conflict, or even crimes of aggression, where one state violates the sovereignty and independence of another state through armed force. Well, imagine if the crime of ecocide, which occurs when the natural environment of a given territory is destroyed to such an extent that the survival of its inhabitants is threatened. Well, imagine if the crime of ecocide were to become illegal under international law. This is all very interesting, but what difference is this going to make? Well, imagine if heads of state and corporations were legally bound to put the well-being of people before profit. This would resolve many of our problems with pollution or the destruction of ecosystems and climate change. Yeah, that's great, but honestly, what do you think I can do about it? First of all, we aim to collect 1 million signatures from European citizens so that laws against ecocide can be discussed in the EU Parliament. The next step is to bring this law to the United Nations and have ecocide recognized as an international crime against peace. Then companies and individuals will be held responsible for destroying livelihoods of people and other living creatures. So tell your friends, share this video, use social networks and shout it off the top of a mountain if you like. End ecocide. But before you do any of this, please take two minutes to sign this petition to end ecocide in Europe once and for all.